Are you still Lori? I'm still Lori. And I, uh, I'm Corey, believe it or not. Yep. <laughs> we'll so, see you next time. Yeah, thanks for watching. <laughs> Goodbye. What do you think? You think we got yeah, something? We got I think enough, we got right? something. Yeah. Welcome back to Story Also Rhymes. I'm Corey. I'm Lori. What are we talking about today? Today we're going to talk about tea. Tea. Mm -hmm. It's a little off brand, don't you think? We're a backpacking channel. But you have to drink when you backpack. <laughs> okay, you're gonna have to convince me. Okay, I'll tell you. I'll tell you why I think this is this is something worth considering. Um, you'll probably remember from one of our earlier, well, all of our earlier chats. Anytime I'm I'm involved, it's about being comfortable. So to me, um, trading out the comforts and luxuries, that bringing them with you, having them with you, finding a way to convert them to be backpacking ready. Is, is been, has been my goal. So that's how this fits into me. Excellent. And I actually do really enjoy having tea while we go backpacking. It, it does make a lot of sense. For me, I love a good cup of coffee, but I don't get a lot of good cups of coffee with the little packets, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, they'll get the job done. What yeah. did you say? They check the box. Yeah, they, they check, check the, the box. caffeine box in the morning, but they're not as enjoyable. So before we get into the specifics, um, thank you for everybody that has commented and subscribed and liked. Um, Corey got a comment about an alternate tent, which, I mean, much to my joy and happiness, is going to be cheaper than the one that he was looking into initially. So, um, and has some better options to it too. So, um, thank you for the comments, the ones that have, whether it's on Instagram or here on YouTube. Thank you. It's nice to have the interaction, and we're continuing to learn from people, which is a part of why we're being open and putting ourselves on YouTube. <laughs> Yeah, we've also had some nice comments about things to maybe add to the description, um, uh, things like that, or additional information to provide. Mm -hmm. That's helpful mm -hmm. um, because if you're interested in that, I, that would stand to reason that someone else is as well. And we really want to benefit people. That's the whole idea. Is mm -hmm. We think like even with this tea, uh, it enriches our experience when we go backpacking. Yeah. So if it can enrich yours and make you more comfortable, well, that's great, right? That's that's kind of what we're after. Yeah. Okay, so coffee versus tea, like what we usually pack in versus what other people might do with coffee. So, so getting down to the nitty gritty grams, right? Thinking uh, the weight that you have. Mm -hmm. uh, the packets are pretty light of coffee, right? Um, I would still imagine that tea, uh, you can bring five days worth of tea, it's pretty lightweight, mm -hmm. honestly. I don't think you're gonna get much lighter than that. Mm -hmm. Uh, if you want to bring a great cup of coffee yeah. like and there's people that do you get the backpacking grinders the pour over i mean because well that's for their experience yeah. too they're so into that that that's what they want to do please come backpacking with us and make me a good strong cup of and coffee i'll make you a good <laughs> cup of tea <laughs> but i'm not gonna go through the work of doing that yeah. um so well and for me with coffee i have to have cr cream of some sort so now i'm not just i hate the dehydrated so now i'm packing in the little cups and then i've got to pack that trash out too so for me, the tea thing actually just kind of simplifies what I'm carrying. Yeah, and there's reusable diffusers. Like mm -hmm. this is one, this little one, but you can even get smaller ones. I'll put I'll put the picture up right now, but it's very small. It's just about the size of the amount of tea you need, and you just stir it around in your cup. So very reusable. Yeah. So I would say backpacking wise, tea is lighter weight. Okay, and then you think about the benefits. You know, we've heard a lot about the long-term benefits of drinking green tea and antioxidants and cancer fighting and Alzheimer's fighting and all that. So we, we know that, but the other thing that I appreciate about actually drinking caffeinated tea is that it can reduce mental fatigue, but keeping your awareness while you're relaxing. To me, kind of that sounds like the perfect blend. Now I've gone through this physical exertion during the day, so I'm kind of f physically and mentally fatigued a little bit, but I want to feel refreshed, but I don't want to go to sleep. So it's kind of a nice uh, process. And then for me, I always bring a little snack. So to get up and have that treat, whether it's when we get up there in the afternoon or in the evening while I'm trying to stay awake, waiting for the stars to come out, because I always fall asleep so early. Um, so to me, that's some of the, the practical reasons why I think tea is a good alternative to just bringing coffee. Yeah, excellent. So let's get into the uh, okay. the company, the tea that we enjoy. And again, we're not uh, sponsored by this uh, tea company at all. No. It's just we want what this is stuff that's enriching our life, yeah. and uh, we want it, it to enrich yours. Yeah. So a good friend of mine um, ordered me a sample pack, and I was very excited. But so she brought over the sample pack, and I was so blown away by some of these flavors. Um, two of the ones that I really like are the organic green tea with vanilla and cardamom. It literally has cardamom seeds inside, 
like you can see the chunks of what's happening. And that's something that August um, says on their website that they are, they, they were determined to have a high quality specialty tea that was blended because a lot of times if you drink the, um, well, just the cheaper stuff at the grocery store, it tastes chemically and manufactured and kind of not, not natural. Um, the, another one of theirs that I like is the, um, it's a rooibos tea with amaretto and orange blossom. Um, both, um, this one's decaf, but then of course the green has some caffeine. It Those says are, velvety rooibos. It does say velvety. And they have really cool names for all of them, um, you know. So. This, this is my favorite. It's called Low Country. It's a black tea, so it's got the caffeine for you. Gives you the kick. But it's black tea with bourbon and burnt sugar notes, and you can smell it when oh, when you start steeping it. There's another one, crisp black tea with a chili and chocolate. Again, just delicious yeah. teas. And when you order, if you order, there's 10, there 10 sample pack, it rotates all the time. So I just went to order some for a friend this morning and was like, oh man, I want I want those flavors. So they change them over a lot. The tea is re-steepable. You can use it twice. I have found that to be true. It's that high quality. Um, also, I made a mistake on an order this morning and I put the billing address of what should have been the shipping address and I quick emailed them. They emailed me back. We got it squared away. I have had such good customer service with this company. Um, so, and you know, they're, they're based out of uh, Southern California and Los Angeles, a smaller company. Um, they seem very family, family based. So yeah. I don't know, I, can, I like supporting um, the, li the littler guys. The little guys. And again, it's August and the, uh, they're uncommon tea. Uh, just some other points about it. It's all natural, vegan, gluten-free, non-GMO. Um, so it, it checks all those boxes for you mm -hmm. as well. Yep. Um, but that's, you know, like I said, that's a tea we like. Mm -hmm. It's something that enriches our life. Hopefully it will you as well. Well, and I look forward to drinking it. It isn't like it's just something that, okay, it's really cold and I need to warm up. I actually look forward to having it. So again, this goes back to bring with you what you're going to look forward to enjoying and it's going to enhance your experience. So to me, this falls under that category. And I would love to hear if there's something that you feel like um, you like you what you think would be good to bring backpacking or you do bring backpacking whether it's a treat a snack a tea something like that this is about bringing being comfortable you know i try not to bring too much but i want to bring enough to be comfortable and have a good time yeah let's narrow it keep it narrowed to like food items that we'll in another time we'll do our sure our guilty pleasure things that we bring that sounds good okay <laughs> sounds reasonable right? uh, yeah fine and uh as we mentioned before um you have already enriched us by some of your comments and things like that. So by continuing to comment yeah. and let us know those things, it's only going to make our experience better as well. Yeah. So right. very good. Um, subscribe. Yeah. Uh, like. Questions down below. Yep. Questions down below. We have an Instagram. Yeah. Um, you can follow us on Instagram as well. Yeah. Um, share us with your friends. Yeah. And, and, and again, like we have some planned upcoming content, but if there's something you want to see, I think one of our friends did comment on something they were interested in. If there's something you think we should be talking about that we're not talking about, I would like to know that too, because we can adjust programming. We have full control yeah. over what we put up. So. We also went over 50 subscribers. <laughs> Woohoo! So that's more than we have friends and family. So we've obviously... Uh, uh, so somebody out there thought, thought this was there worth thought spending this. eight minutes of their life on. <laughs> Okay. Well, thanks so much for being here. We'll look forward to seeing any comments that you have for us. And I am still Lori. And I'm Corey. And we'll see you next time. And goodbye. Bye. See you later. Have a good day. Oh, S2 is okay. at the door. Go get the cat. Bye. Last word. It's too cold for that poor cat outside. <laughs> she is not a backpacking kitty. <laughs> okay. Want to do it one more time? Goodbye. Yeah. You can you can leave it out. I was trying to do something different. You know, sometimes we do yeah. something different. So thanks again for watching.